morning, gentlemen. Hey there. How are you? Well, well hello. Dandy, how are you? Not bad at all. Where are you, man? Uh, I'm at uh, home at this point. Really? We should. Ha- we have a camera there, I think, don't we? Or do you not I'm know excited. about that? There's one in the bedroom. Yeah, but we don't turn that one hello, on right Hello, hello. It's a family Listen, show. Hello, yeah. Um, ah. No, started a little vacation today. The kids are on a fall break, so awesome. I took some time off to spend some time with the uh, with the little boys. But, um, yeah, I uh, watched the game yesterday with the kids, and I tell you what, the two nine-year-olds, their reaction was, Dad, it's a win. I mean, you're yelling at the screen and close, <laughs> and it's a you know, seven-point lead in the last minute, and... If, the, if by some miracle the Jets put together a drive, they could tie the game. They're like, hey, they, they won. What, 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 what's the problem? So I think that's kind of, you know, the main uh, the main take from this one, guys. Uh, I know on the show last week, Aaron, I said this was going to be a scrimmage for the uh, for the Broncos. Whoops. And Well, it was. It was a close scrimmage. <laughs> there you go. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, they almost, look, yeah, yeah. Was there any point in the game that you thought the Broncos were going to lose? No. There was no. I don't care what happened in that game. They got within seven after the Decker touchdown. I still had no, no feeling that the Jets were going to be able to come back and win this game. And they didn't. So Lee made the big play at the end. Um, Von Miller almost got a safety on a sack. The, the, the Broncos were never in danger. Okay, in the NFL, that's the way it's going to be. Um, and they did what they wanted to do. They worked on the running game. Hillman got 100 yards. Uh, Peyton had his usual three touchdown pass per game uh, clip. And the defense looked good. And, and they won the football game at MetLife Stadium where they had gotten blown out of the Super Bowl. So all's well on, uh, on Victory Monday to me. Well, here's the thing. And we keep talking about a complete game. I haven't seen this team put together four quarters. Haven't seen, you know, the offense click uh, for an extended period of time. Defense uh, showed up at the end. Once again, they make the play. But, but Lionel, at some point, uh, don't we need to see this team put things together? I mean, look, w- they're five games into the season, and I think there's some real questions as to what's going on. You know, is this a team? Yesterday they had the same amount of runs as they did passes, 33 and 33. Peyton Manning's your quarterback. Why do we need that kind of balance? Why not throw the football? What happened to the Broncos team that was setting all these record scoring points last year? I have some concerns because I just don't think, as of yet, this team has been able to put it together. And I wonder when they do. I haven't seen a perfect game. Yeah, maybe giving the, uh, the other teams reason to think, hey, we could beat these guys. Hey, Amen. Your thoughts, LB? Well, dude, look, I mean, they, there is no perfect game in the NFL. They're 4-1 and one right now. Uh, they're probably going to be number two in the NFL power rankings behind the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, beat Seattle. What do you think they're saying in Seattle right now? They've lost two games already. I mean, yeah, right. the only the only game the Broncos lost was an overtime game in Seattle. All right, that's it. Or they'd be perfect on the year so far. Uh, you know, they'd be five and zero without that loss in Seattle. I, I I agree. There are things you need to work on, but there's never going to be a perfect game. I mean, at one point they were zero for five on third down conversions. They they jump up seventeen to seven, and then kind of coast, and you're like, all right, come on, come on, put this team away, put this Jets team away, don't let them get within seven in the fourth quarter. But then they shut the door and won the game. I, I don't think you're going to see uh, a, a, a complete... All right, uh, Lionel, hold on know, just a second, buddy. I, we're going to get to weather real quick. We'll get right back to you. Hang in there. Oh, sure. Go ahead. Lisa, head down. And good morning. Well, here's what we're looking at outside right now. Temperatures in the 30. It's a cold start for you. You're going to want the jacket and the gloves, of course, as you're walking out the door. Highs, though, today, 58 degrees. It's going to feel better than yesterday. More sunshine expected. Now, as we head into tomorrow, we're up into the 70s and then the 80s by Wednesday. And now we're back. Okay, Lionel, I'm sorry. We kind of interrupted you there. What do you think about the, 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 you think about the number of yards of penalties they had yesterday? Oh, penalties. 11 penalties, 101 yards, LB. Whew. Yes. No, no, no. You're right. There are things to work on. Uh, there are things that are never going to be perfect. I think they went in, though, Aaron, your point about, the, about running is that they wanted to use this game um, <laughs> as a scrimmage to kind of establish the run. And let's say Ronnie Hillman's first start. Okay, this is it. Let's give him the ball, see what he can do. Let's try to make that happen because down the road, whether it's against San Fran next week, New England the next week, San Diego, whatever, down the road, we are going to need to run the football at some point. Let's try to do it to th- th- this week. Let's do it. Let's give it to Ronnie. Let's see what he can do. Um, I, we're going to beat the Jets, I think, was in their mind no matter what. So let's, let's just go in and, and try to do that. And I think, you know, to some success, 100 yards for home, they ran the ball, they got some third down in shorts uh, with the running game. 
So I think that's what they were trying to do yesterday. Um, I, I think when it comes to, like I said, 49ers, Chargers, Patriots down the road, that they will not run the ball as much unless they have to, that they will use Peyton Manning. They will use the best passing offense in the history of the NFL from last year. But they did put up 31 points. I know Akeem got seven of those on a, on a pick six. But I, I'm i struggling to kind of, uh, you know, to kind of nitpick this team again every week as we do because I think they will put together uh, four quarters when they have to, hopefully. If, they, if they've got to play that well down the road against a really good team, that they will be able to do that. I've got the confidence that they will. Yesterday, the Jets, they did what they needed to do to win. They got out of New Jersey with a W. They established the run game. Payton threw three touchdown passes. Um, I'm not, I'm not too upset that there were lulls in the game that they didn't, you know, play a complete four quarters yesterday. Yeah, it's kind of hard to whine too much, isn't it? Well, Lionel, thanks for joining us on your vacation. We appreciate it. All right, you. guys, anytime. I, all right, I'm surprised that you were able to. Uh, to you rouse know, you up? What, what, yeah, what time did your alarm go off <laughs> What today? do you mean? So, I don't know how to take that. What do you mean a surprise? Are you kidding? Well, <laughs> hey, when the phone call, call comes, call I answer it. It's, it's like one of those things where you call, hey, how you doing? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm up. I, I've been up for, for a while. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've been up. I've been up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what, well, yeah. What time is it? What, 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 who is this? No. Wow. Good right. to see you, man. I'm watching you guys on the web, on the 7 News app. Channel.com live stream video looking good. I love the uh, sports coat and jeans look, aren't? Oh. You know, and I thought I would Chris in the new impeccable, studio. impeccably dressed as always. You man. should yeah. see my socks; they're actually Broncos colored. Oh, I brought some Rick. kick, dude. Yeah, <laughs> I did. Those, those, those are I awesome. hold them up. I don't know if you can see. Those okay. are snappy. Yeah, these are right here. If, if, if nothing else, uh, LB, I, I can just picture you sitting there in your loudmouth Broncos orange and blue jacket, sipping coffee. This is great. We're so glad that you took time out well, to I wish join us. I wish off. I was on Skype or, or I wish there was a camera, a webcam or something, because uh, uh, I'm in pajama, long pajama pants, mm -hmm. uh, a tank top, and I do have coffee with uh, sitting at, looking at my computer watching YouTube. That's, that's quite a picture That's right a there. great way to start vacation, yeah. man. You know how to party. <laughs> that's it, man. Well, enjoy the family this week. All right, guys. Anytime. Good right. work. Get to that honeydew list, man. Yeah.